Now to a developing story out of Niagara Falls, where the city school district is investigating a case of bullying that happened last night. Now a worried parent contacted two on your sides, Keelan Berrien, and he confirmed the story. Keelan joins us in the studio now with more on what the district is doing to protect students. Keelan. All right, Mary Allison Scott. School officials confirmed this case of bullying and told me it involves a 13 year old. The student's parent and guardian wants to protect the youngster and asked us not to identify any of them. They say the 13 year old student was pants in front of the junior varsity football team. Now, pantsing is someone yanking another individual's pants down as a prank or joke. But Superintendent Lori says in this case, it was done as an act of bullying. Lori says the student accused of pantsing the 13 year old has been suspended as well as removed from the JV football team. The district plans to file a sexual harassment complaint, which Lori says is the district's protocol. Now, Lori is aware that bullying happens in his schools and encourages everyone to take the necessary steps to protect students. We always tell students if they're feeling or hearing or uh, receiving bullying, they've got to go to a trusted adult. We have a trusted adult program in almost every one of our schools. If a student doesn't have a trusted adult, they can go right to their administrator, their principal, their vice principal, their dean of students, and report it. Everything that is uh, reported is acted upon, recorded, uh, investigated, uh, and hopefully stopped. Now, Lori says they have programs encouraging students to come forward if they're being bullied. Now, Lori also says the district takes incidents like this very seriously. He and the school issue in an apology to the student and the parent. On your side in the studio, Keelan Berrien, Channel 2 News.